Good morning to the WIPS family. Today at WIPS we are celebrating Heritage Day, which takes place tomorrow. And because of the Heritage Day public holiday, we've been given a long weekend. And for that, we need to be grateful. It is lovely to see all the boys and girls, as well as staff members, dressed in their proudly heritage outfits to commemorate such a special day in our country. Today we are proud of what we have done and who we are. We are happy that on Heritage Day we can celebrate and embrace our differences and similarities while also showing acts of kindness. I have a story I wish to share with all of you today and it's entitled The Rainbow Fish. Far out in the sea lived a fish. No ordinary fish, however. He was the most beautiful fish in the entire ocean. His scales shimmered with all the colors of the rainbow. The other fish admired his colorful scales and called him Rainbow Fish. Come on, play with us, Rainbow Fish. But Rainbow Fish was proud and swam past them. A little blue fish swam alongside beside him. Rainbow Fish, wait for me. Please could I have one of your glittering scales? They are so beautiful and you have so many. Give you one of my scales? What are you thinking of? cried Rainbow Fish. Get away from me. Shocked, the little blue fish swam away. The little blue fish was very sad and told the other fish. From then on, nobody wanted any more to do with Rainbow Fish. They turned away from him when he swam past. What use were Rainbow Fish's beautiful scales if they were no longer admired by anyone? Now Rainbow Fish was the loneliest fish in the entire ocean. One day he poured out his sorrow to a starfish. I'm so beautiful, why doesn't anybody like me? The starfish told Rainbow Fish to go to a cave behind a coral reef where a wise octopus lived. Perhaps he can help you, the starfish advised him. Rainbow Fish found the cave. It was very dark and he could hardly see anything. Then suddenly he saw two glowing eyes. I have been expecting you, said the octopus in a deep voice. The waves have told me your story. Listen to my advice. Share your glittering scales with some of the other fish. Then you may not be the most beautiful fish in the ocean, but you will be happy again. But Rainbow Fish began to say, but Octopus had already disappeared in a dark cloud of ink. Give away my scales, my beautiful glittering scales, thought Rainbow Fish, horrified. Never, no, how could I be happy without them? The next day, Rainbow Fish felt the light touch of a fin. The little blue fish was back. Rainbow Fish, please don't be angry with me. Please can I have one of your glittering scales, just a small one? Rainbow Fish hesitated. A very, very small scale, he thought. Why not? I will hardly miss it. Rainbow Fish carefully pulled off the very smallest of his glittering scales. Here, I'll give you this one. Thank you, thank you very much, burbled the little blue fish excitedly. You are so kind, Rainbow Fish. Rainbow Fish felt quite strange. He watched the little blue fish for a long time as he swam away happily through the water with his glittering scale, turning this way and that. The little blue fish darted through the water with his glittering scale and soon Rainbow Fish was surrounded by other fish. The other fish knew that Rainbow Fish was kind now, so they wanted to be his friend. Rainbow Fish was happy, happier than he'd ever been. What did the story teach us at Whoops? It teaches us that showing a bit of kindness to someone can change your life for the better. Sharing what you have with others can make a big difference in your life as well as their lives. Nobody likes a show-off.
Everybody likes someone who is kind. And let us not forget, kindness, like a boomerang, always returns. So today, as we celebrate being proudly South African or any other heritage that is part of our family, be proud for being you. Be proud of what you have done for other people. Be proud of being you, but also boys, don't forget, be proud for the right reasons. And we end with a little quote, kindness makes you the most beautiful person in the world, no matter what you look like. Let us pray. Dear God, thank you for all of the things in my life, for giving me the opportunity to be kind to others and to be proud of who I am. May we always pray to have eyes that see the best in people, a heart that forgives the worst, a mind that forgets the bad, and a soul that never loses faith. Amen. Thank you to all the whips, boys and girls, and to our staff for expressing acts of kindness and love to animals in need today. We have for sure collected a large amount of coins, which will go to the animal shelters in need in and around Pretoria.